मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट द मिनिमल इक्वेशन ऑफ ए ब्लॉक डायगनल मैट्रिक्स एंड द प्रोसेस फॉर फाइंडिंग द मिनिमल इक्वेशन ऑफ ए ब्लॉक डायगनल मैट्रिक्स ओके सो द मिनिमल इक्वेशन ऑफ ए पॉलिनोमियल और ए मिनिमल पॉलिनोमियल और वी कैन से दैट द मिनिमल इक्वेशन ऑफ ए ब्लॉक डायगनल मैट्रिक्स इज ए मिनिमल पॉलिनोमियल ऑफ ए मैट्रिक्स ए आई आई वेयर आई एंड आई इज द ऑर्डर ऑफ द मैट्रिक्स इज डिनोटेड बाय एम ए लैमडा ओके एंड वी नो दैट द वी नो अबाउट द ब्लॉक डायगनल मैट्रिक्स इन आवर प्रीवियस लेक्चर and suppose that we have a block diagonal matrix and we know that in a block diagonal matrix we have more than one matrix in the blocks uh, in the diagonal of a matrix of a square matrix and the matrix is known as a block diagonal matrix uh, then the minimal polynomial of the block diagonal matrix is uh, represented by m a lambda and where lambda is the eigen value it is equal to lcm of the characteristic of the first uh, matrix in the diagonal uh, uh, and lcm of the characteristic of the first matrix of the diagonal and cr equation of the second matrix of the diagonal and so on if we have the m matrix in the diagonal Uh, for example suppose that we have a block diagonal matrix in which the uh, in uh, in this matrix the element of the diagonals are the uh, are the square matrix or a matrix uh, or a matrix and this is a first matrix is uh, denoted by a11 and a second matrix is a22 and this matrix is block diagonal because uh, because only the diagonal elements are the matrix and other mat other elements are zero so uh, for finding the uh, uh, minimal polynomial of this matrix first we uh, first we find out uh, the characteristic polynomial of first matrix a11 and then finding the characteristic polynomial of second matrix a22 <laughs> and we know that uh, this uh, we know that the uh, characteristic polynomial of a11 a11 is uh, a and lambda minus a eta uh, lambda eta minus a or a minus lambda eta then after solving the a minus lambda determinant of a minus lambda eta equal to 0 we have the characteristic polynomial of this equation is lambda minus 1 and lambda minus 5 and characteristic polynomial and the roots of this equation is lambda minus 1 and lambda minus 4 where lambda is the eigen value of this matrix okay and the characteristic Uh, equation of this block diagonal matrix is lambda minus one, lambda minus five, lambda minus one, and lambda minus four. And then the minimal polynomial of this matrix is the LCM of the characteristic polynomial of the first matrix and the uh, characteristic polynomial of second matrix. Then LCM of the uh, CR equation of first matrix and uh, CR equation of second matrix it is equal to the LCM of this is lambda minus one, lambda minus five, and lambda minus four. This is the minimal polynomial of this. characteristic equation okay and this block diagonal matrix and basically the minimal the uh, def definition of the minimal polynomial is uh, let uh, lambda is the eigen value then the p lambda p lambda the polynomial of lambda is the minimal polynomial of the n cross n matrix a if p lambda is the monic polynomial of least degree such that p a equal to 0 it's mean always the minimal polynomial satisfy uh, all satisfy the uh, condition p a equal to 0 it's mean if we have a p lambda is a minimal polynomial then if we put uh, at the place of lambda a at the place of lambda a uh, it's mean if we put at the place of lambda the matrix a then the uh, resultant is 0 it's mean the uh, the resultant polynomial is a minimal polynomial okay this is the definition of minimal polynomial and this is the process for finding the minimal polynomial of a jordan block matrix okay for finding the bi diag uh, for finding the jordan canonical form the second important part is bi diagonal matrix and bi diagonal matrix is a matrix in which all the elements of the diagonal element uh, all the elements uh, in the diagonal are the eigen value and the all the element in super diagonals are always one that is a matrix a equal to a i j m n cross n a square matrix is a bi diagonal matrix if 
इफ इट इज डिफाइंड एज ए इक्वल टू ए आई आई इक्वल टू के फॉर आई इक्वल टू वन टू एन दैट इज ऑल द एलिमेंट्स इन द डायगनल आर सम uh all the elements in the diagonals are the eigen value and and all the elements in the diagonals are the real number or complex number complex number but if a i i plus 1 i a i i plus 1 means the element in the super diagonal of the matrix uh it's mean if i equal to 1 then uh the second indices is uh 1 plus 1 2 it's mean 1 2 uh, the element situated in first row and second column similarly if i equal to then element situated in second row and third column and similarly i equal to 4 then element situated in fourth row and five fifth column so all the elements in the super diagonal always equal to 1 then such time matrix is known as bi diagonal matrix for example a equal to this in the diagonal elements all the elements elements are uh, from uh, the list of eigen value of this matrix and all the elements are the eigen value of the matrix but the super diagonal elements are 1 1 1 and other elements are 0 okay this type matrix is known as bi diagonal matrix or uh, a second example is uh, 1 1 0 0 and this is the second example in which all the elements in the diagonals are uh, are the eigen value of this matrix but the super diagonal elements always equal to 1 this is the bi diagonal matrix okay and the second important part uh, for learning the jordan canonical form is jordan block a bi diagonal matrix is said to be jordan block if all the diagonal elements are equal okay the uh, second important part is jordan block and jordan block is a matrix in which all the elements in the diagonals are uh, are always equal and the super diagonal element is r111 okay and the equal elements are coming from the eigen value of a matrix and all the elements in the diagonals are equal and super diagonal elements are 111 this type matrix is known as jordan block